What's going on, everybody? This is Super Robot, and today we're going to talk about none other than this. What we've all been speculating, what a lot of people have been kind of on the, upset about on the fence. Transformer Studio Series 86 Commander Class Ultra Magnus is needed. I'm, I, this is needed. No sorry, no apologies to whomever. I'm not attacking anyone. But having to upgrade Combiner Wars to get some semblance of what we got now, that's your fault. I know a lot of people spend those, put money into those third party upgrades because they thought that we weren't going to get another this or that. And how many Ultra Magnus have we had in a period of six to seven years? Eight years? Eight years. We've had four Ultra Magnus Combiner Wars. Um, we had um, Siege, Earth uh, Kingdom, and. Um, well, four, because five, actually, because I've left out the Legends version and the Target exclusive one. But you had to get two upgrade kits, X2 Toys and PC-17 from uh, Perfect Effect. We're talking a, it's a hundred dollar, it's a hundred dollar, a minimum hundred dollars to upgrade him, to have a semblance of him. And I know a lot of people don't want to justify the fact that, you know, you should have learned, you should know by now how Hasbro works. They're going to keep doing the figure over and over again. That's why I never got into those third party upgrades with Combiner Wars, and especially Menasaur, because there's nothing you can do to fix that toy. It's not posable. Trust me, I have the third party. I have a knockoff. It's the same third. It's just a knockoff version. It does the exact same thing as the uh, Perfect Effect kit. It, it just switched the legs. It's, it's hard. I never like Combiner Wars, Menasaur. All the other Combiner Wars, I never. But this, this, this is Ultra Magnus. All the other ones, whether you want to put them up or shut up, they ain't looking like this, bro. This is what the fandom wants. And the fandom Commander Class Ultra Magnus Studio Series 86 Commander Ultra, this thing is going to be hot. You know you're going to get it. You know you're going to get it. I don't care who you are. This is the definitive Ultra Magnus for the main line. There is no other. There is no other. I I was ready to quit the fandom. I was so annoyed with every repaint after repaint after repaint after repaint. I'm sick of it now. I don't care for G2. I don't care for Shattered Glass. I don't care for none of that. Hell, I don't even care for some of the Armada figures. Just I don't really care for the Cybertron trilogy. I watched it. I liked it. But I don't care for it. Like I care for G1. Just me all day. This figure right here is me all day. Nothing I want. I'm looking at my Ultra Magnus like, oh man, I spent money just to upgrade you with bigger thighs. Boy, Hasbro, boy. Hasbro, Hasbro, Hasbro. You got me. You got me. You got my web 100. This is very close to the masterpiece. Very close to the masterpiece. Y'all bugging if you think your Combiner Wars is better than this. Y'all are bugging, man. And I like the X2 Toys upgrade. I thought that was one of the better upgrades for Combiner Wars, but I knew in my soul not to invest in anything has invest in third-party upgrades. Maybe the, the cheap ones, you know, like shoulder cannons and stuff like that for none. But no. None of them got a Matrix. It's got a funny, they got a funny guy in it. I don't know nothing about that IDW shit. Shit. This is what I know. This is what I know. This is the blocky, chunky Ultra Magnus. He looks like he came right out the movie. The correct proportions, chest, size, paint. And in ways, I think this is better than the masterpiece. The white, the red, the blue. An American color. Now we can get the Delta Magnus we deserve. I'm so glad I didn't buy any more Ultra Magnuses after um Kingdom. I am so glad. I knew it. I was I knew it. I I I, I always foresee things with Hasbro because Hasbro is predictable. I've been doing with dealing with this company for 20 for longer than some of y'all been alive. So I know how they roll. I know we we I knew this was coming. But for y'all that spent that money on third party upgrades, y'all man, look at look at that. Look at look at that. You're gonna man. 
Take that. Oh my god. Do you see this? Y'all ain't seeing this. Y'all are not seeing this. If you saying to yourself right now, Combiner Wars and any other Ultra Magnus is better than this, you are insane, man. Look at the back of the figure they got. Oh my, they did. Look at what they did. Look at what they did. And I thought Armada uh, Optimus Prime might have been Commander of the Year. It's a good one. I ain't got it yet, but it's a good one. And I'm still going to get it. <sighs> I am. I am. I'm. Please, when is this come out? When? When I I I got to have I need this boy. I'm yo. I'm so inclined. Man. I want this toy so bad. I might even go through the nefarious channels that I would not go through. I want this now. I don't want to wait. I don't want to wait or complain. If I can get it as soon as possible, and y'all want to call me a thief, I don't care. I want this figure now. Give me now. Give me. Give me. Give me. I don't know if I'll do that, but. You know, if I can get it from like Malaysia, you know, in the full packaging faster than I get in the States, I know how to do it. I know how to do it. Don't worry about that. I'm getting this. I'm not waiting for and fighting with y'all pre-orders. None of that. Or oh, $50 from Has to pay Hasbro to get it. This figure is going to get in my hands very soon. I want two of him because I want to do a little customization. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Y'all. I haven't, I had, I look at these pictures. I had to stop, man. I had to stop. Man. My, 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 I, my eyes were just like, I have seen Hasbro's best. All right, y'all. This is Hasbro's best. This is, this is it, man. This is it. This is it. This is what we, this is, I pray there's no QC issues. I pray, and though I do see some things at the chest, they ain't show us that part. What are them hinges out there for? You know, hmm, clear plastic on the sides there. Interesting. It seems like they're covering up the chest. But maybe it's, I don't know, something. I, but anyway, still. Yeah, I might be able to deal with the flaws. I might be able to deal with the flaws on this one. I, I, I might be able to be inclined to deal with the flaws on this one I want this figure you should want this figure it's ultra Mag this is ultra and I don't care about any other ultra Magnus this is ultra Magnus. maybe it's R.I.D. for you maybe it's combiner wars for you maybe it's uh, uh, animated for you, which are all in their own ways all are good but this ain't G1 ultra Magnus this ain't the G1 Magnus that said, open deck. I can't deal with that right now. <laughs> Robert Stack. You know what I'm saying? Y'all know Robert Stack, my, he unsolved mysteries, but when I was a kid, he was in this show called Strike Force, man. It's like a cop. It was like a like a gritty cop show. They used to show it like late nights on Fridays. And I was like maybe seven, six or seven years old in the early 80s. Had Robert Stack, Dorian Harewood, Harewood and a few other actors and actresses. Um, it's actually a pretty good show. I'm always be mad. I'm watching the show, but I just like car chases. <laughs> I always be like, "What are you running in the cars?" Seven, eight year old kid who don't like cars and blowing up stuff. But this is Ultra Magnus. What are your thoughts? Leave down in the comments below. This is Super Raw Dad. Bring you a news reviews today. We we'll see you soon. Bye bye.